Okay, so we have some bad news and good news. <laughs> the video just started, um, and well, first of all, someone took my seat. I'll insert a picture so you can see that. Second of all, my camera died and I cannot find my charger or my other batteries. And I did just recently move around um, my like office space, so now I'm worried. Um, but I wanna <laughs> just go ahead and get on with this video. And since I got the new iPhone, my video quality is really actually decent so we're gonna try to film this on my phone and um my memory cards are a little full anyway so <laughs> but today i woke up to the sound of my ring doorbell and i saw that it was an everline box and i was freaking out because i won an everline um video call recently and i was like oh my gosh did the call already happen without me knowing? But then I did realize this was Quantum B. Um, season greetings. And I knew it was getting delivered today. Uh, I didn't think it was going to get delivered at 11 a.m. Also, let me know if you guys liked the intro to the video. I thought it was fun. Um, I have a lot of unboxing videos that I ended up scrapping because I'm just not used to hearing my voice on video for long periods of time. Uh, and I really liked the way I sounded in the RM video and that was when I first woke up before I had coffee so I thought it'd be fun to make a coffee and maybe I'll make a new one each time also my whole family is home so you will definitely hear people in the background so I'll try to cut it out as much as I can but I'm not gonna make them stop talking just so I can open a video first thing in the morning or a package today I made a regular latte Oh, no syrup or anything. I'm trying to get back into just Americanos, but I just enjoy coffee too much. So I don't care anymore. <laughs> but yeah, so I ordered the season greeting during the first pre-order batch. <gasps> Whoa, this is my first ever season greetings as well. And I'm very excited. You guys know I love, well, uh, actually I keep trying to figure out, I don't think you guys on YouTube know I love Quantum B so much because every unboxing video I filmed for her I haven't posted because it was either badly filmed or the lighting was terrible or I hated the way I sounded uh so I think this will be my first quantum B video but there is another one coming um probably in February and then there is another one coming uh I don't know when but there will be a lot of quantum B themed videos in the future um, I don't, if you follow me on other Instagrams, you know what happened between me and Quantum B. <laughs> and if you don't, um, I'm not going to give it away because I want it to be a surprise video for my YouTubers. Um, but yeah, so I did get, a uh, pre-order benefit. I was hoping that it was going to be the full set of pre-order benefits, but it looks like it was only one. But that's okay, we'll take it. Um, the bad thing about me and Quantum B is I actually prefer her pre-order cards over her, like, typical cards it's so cute i really liked the green outfit so i'm excited because i feel like it matches so i can like display it like this but yeah i've never had a season greetings before um because before i didn't realize like these even existed and uh i really love the idea that i actually want to do it for me and you cafe next year um as like a fundraiser and like way to raise money but like also like I want to include like maybe the merch um like a calendar with like me and you cakes and then or like drawings or something so I thought it I think just think it's such a good merch idea like and I know like she's not the only one that does it like all k-pop groups basically do it um but I just think it's like there's some merch items that I'm like this feels just like a cash grab and I'm sure this is, but <laughs> it's like also stuff that people can use and people like the calendar just blows my mind or not blows my mind, but like the calendar. And then like, obviously we all love photo books and stuff, but I don't know. I just like merch items. Like I really loved New Jeans's first album. That was a bag. I wasn't even going to buy their album because I didn't keep any of the photo cards, photo book, anything like that, but I did love their music. So I wanted like a little memento from that one day I listened to Hype Boy like for four hours straight and it was a bag so now I just have a bag hanging and sometimes I use it but so anyways long story short 
I really like season greetings and I had to decide between hers, VVZ's, Red Velvets or Classies and since I already have a classy photo book, well actually no, it wasn't even a question, I got Quantum Beast because she's like my ult, my ult ult. So I do like that it's in this box and then comes with a clear case so you can see things. I don't know, I kind of like that a lot. I like the design of it. Um, but yeah, I didn't even hesitate. I But I only got one season greetings because I was like, I don't need 15 calendars. And then like on Instagram, I did join some goes. So like for the VVZ, they had little standees that I thought were really cute. So I got those for like only $12. Um, with I got three pre-order or two pre-order photo cards with it. So that's great. And then um, classy, I did get like the memo board or the memo message and photo cards for the three members that I like collect and then red velvet I got stuff from the SMCU palace and then recently I got into the seraphim so much guys I love Sakura like I love Sakura I've been watching her gaming content from when she was a Japanese idol and so I did get her season greetings like set like the photo card and stuff, but I'll, I'll open that when it gets here. We can talk about that. This is Quantum Beast time. But yeah, so this is the calendar. I'm probably still gonna hear my voice because anytime I un unbox like Quantum Beast stuff, I get a little too excited. But so for those of you that were thinking about this, oh, that's so cute. So she does have like the pictures here from this. I am actually gonna use this calendar. I'm gonna get like little sticky notes things and basically the days I have cakes or the days I'm fully booked, I'm going to put it there so I can like look at the calendar every day and let myself know. Um, but I don't want to write over it because I am a collector now, guys. <laughs> I feel so weird being a collector, but I really love it. And honestly, the more I get into Quantum V, like herself, like watch her YouTube channel and like see the way she interacts with her, with herself, with her fans and stuff like... I feel like proud to be a Ruby like you can tell she cares about like I'm not being Delulu I'm not saying oh my god she knows me she cares about me like I just mean you can tell like she actually considers her fans and I'm sure you know every idol is different than what they portray in video but you can just tell that she's like I don't know just chill she's cool she seems cool <laughs> um but yeah I like how close she is with her fans like how she like tries to include them in a lot of stuff but she did say in a video recently that she got to meet her overseas fans in Japan for this year, for 2022. And so I actually have the opportunity to ask her a question soon. And so I'm going to ask her if she'll come to LA and meet her overseas fans here in the US. So yeah, I really like the calendar. It's not like flimsy. You're not going to have to like set this down, like just the paper. It has this backing. So I'm excited to use it. I'm gonna put it right there. It's pretty big as well. Oh, the photo cards got me, man. I didn't see the photo cards when I was purchasing. I went so fast. Cause I did order this from Wollum slash Everline. Um, and they were doing a video call event, but I never figured out where the winners were listed or anything. And honestly, I just wanted the Polaroid. I'm a sucker for signed items right now. Like, I can't even, I need to stop, um, but I kept winning signed items, so I thought I was just going to win everything, but then I didn't win it, so, um, but when I saw the photo cards later, I was like, oh, I'm so glad I got hers, like, look at this, they're so cute, they seem like, it's interesting because they seem wintry, right, but they also seem like fresh, I think the makeup maybe helps, and then the wardrobe seems wintry. Oh, this one's cute. But okay, so this is the pre-order one to this one. Which, like I said, I was excited that I got this because it matches this. So like, after the, the year's over, which that's going to be crazy, it's going to be 2024, I'll be able to display these two with this. Because hopefully by the end of the year, I'll have a cafe. And then um, my goal at my cafe is to have like a glass case, like a longer one lined up on a wall somewhere. And then I'm going to have like a... A uh, column for like quantum be a column for red velvet column for Cassie. classy i'm talking i need more coffee basically one day i'll maybe i'll make a video of like planning out the design of me and you 
so you guys can see what I'm talking about. But I really love these photo cards. They're so pretty. Um, and then this is like postcards, I guess. Like postcard cards. I don't love postcards. I don't know what to do with them. But when I have a cafe one day, these will be like freebies. You can just come and like go through the photo card bucket. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, that's so cute. She drew freckles on her. I really like this outfit. And this one, too. She's so cute. Um, so I normally just keep the photo cards. Because I, I have the first membership box, which I did an unboxing for, but I never posted. Um, and I, since it's like a red box that has, like, closes, I normally keep all my Quantum V inclusions in there as, like, a little memento box. This I was really... <laughs> I was like, girl, <laughs> I love it though. I think it's cute. It reminds me of like school. Like you would get this for like PE class or whatever. Like you're the class of whatever, but it's a workout band. Um, I'm probably gonna wear it when I work out. I'm not even gonna lie. <laughs> Just like encouragement, but I thought it was cute that it's a 2023. And then I'm assuming this means Ruby. Um, but I really like it. This is like something that I think is really cool. Uh, I wonder where she got the idea for a sweatband. Like that's what I want to know. Like what was the concept behind all of this? But it's super cute. I love it. And dorky me will probably use it. Um, anyways. Or I might just like put it on my shelf. But we'll see. And then I'm going to do the photo book last. So these are... I don't think they're stickers. Yeah, they're like pop-out circles. Um, I'm not gonna open these actually. I get so indecisive about whether I wanna like sell this stuff or just like keep it and then like give it away one day. So I probably would just give it away. This I love because it's already laminated. So I can like put it up somewhere and not have to worry about like trying to find a way to put it up. It's so pretty. I love this picture of her. And, um, yeah. So, I think I'll put this up on one of my shelves in the cafe. Um, which I'm planning on doing a cafe tour very soon. So, keep an eye out for that. I'm just waiting on... It will probably be closer to February. Because I have, um, a big order of some stuff I got. Like, whether it was decoration or whether it was, like, actual supplies I needed for me and you. Sorry. And after I cut that BBC album, I'm so scared to cut albums now. Um, but yeah, I'm waiting for that to come and I'm actually gonna wait to unbox it till every item is here and do like a big like unboxing. And then after that, I'm gonna do the tour because there's some items that will help make it look more aesthetic too. Um, but this is the uh, photo book. I love that it's like a magazine feels like a magazine cover. I don't know if that's what it's positioned as, or not positioned, what? What's the word? Oh, maybe if I take another sip of coffee. That didn't help. Con concepted after, that's not the right word, but I wonder if that was the concept. <laughs> um, but yeah, so she's so cute. I saw for her, um, okay, so in her, she basically did like a monthly recap of 2023 on her YouTube channel, and she said that for her next concept, oh, oh my god, I love this outfit though, I love this concept, I love this concept so much, Miss MB, oh, it's the one with the glasses, okay, yeah, <laughs> so cute. Aww. Normally I don't do flip throughs, but this one's pretty easy too. I love the cover. I really like that. It's very unique. Um, but yeah, so this was the unboxing. Oh, I was saying, she said for her next concept, her next album, she wants to try an outdoors natural lighting concept. She said she doesn't know what that would mean, but like, she's like, I have blonde hair now. And like, um, I'm thinking like... It would be so pretty and like natural lighting outdoor and i'm like oh yes i'm for it like can you imagine the photo cards or the photo book oh but like i was like trying to think too like what would that concept be and i'm like 
is she gonna drop a ballad or like I was actually listening to some of her OST music and I was like honestly I'd love if she did a song like that it might not be super crazy on the charts or anything but one thing I do love about Quantum V is like obviously I would love her to like climb the charts be number one have a pack or whatever it's called like win all the awards but she really does make music for herself and for her fans and i really respect that and um but i also think she could do something fun with outdoors but i just automatically thought of like uh <laughs> joy's hello you know what i mean but yeah so that was quantum B's season greetings i'm gonna figure this out. I actually gotta go to the cafe area and make a cake and then I'll figure out sorting where I'm gonna put all this stuff. But I'm gonna go ahead and go put this on my cafe desk and then yeah I will see you guys next time. I think I'm gonna go ahead and post this this weekend so like tomorrow and then so that means the next video you will see is the red velvet video finally. I remember when I started planning that I was like at least it won't be a month late after the concept or after the comeback and it is a month late after the comeback but it was really crazy we had like non-stop rain so there was no sunlight and then all of a sudden i got like a bunch of last minute orders so i never had time to film it so yes red velvet video will be coming on this week i think i was planning for the 17th because the 16th i'm able to edit so fingers crossed but of course check the community page and I'll keep you updated and thank you guys for being so supportive of my channel recently I've gotten a lot of new subscribers and I love seeing new comments from people I don't know because my friends comment a lot and I love them so much <laughs> and their comments are always fun and they genuinely watch my video which makes me so happy but when I see a random person I don't know at all oh it makes my day but I also heard from one person that um, I only heard it from one person, but it also, like, made me super happy that, uh, because of me, they started listening to Quantum B, and they really like her music, so if you started listening to anything by Quantum B because you watched a video or you heard me talk about her on Twitter or Instagram, let me know in the comments, um, and yeah, I'd be really happy to hear that, and then also, if you guys, like, could get any season greetings from any artist k-pop or not like it doesn't have to exist the season greetings just like if you could get one from like a specific actor artist anything twitch streamer i don't care <laughs> what would it be who would it be and let me know in the comments too i'm very interested i would like a goji seasons greeting from my cat i think that would be cute there's also these two otter oh now i'm just rambling i'm gonna go okay goodbye guys <laughs>